With this Picasso's first name. Pablo. Oh, different guy. Uh, how did you meet Pablo? I was about two weeks ago. I was walking down the street one afternoon, and I turned up the stairs into my flat and looked back, and there he was, framed in the doorway looking up at me. I couldn't see his face because the light was coming from behind him. He was in shadow, and he said, I am Picasso. And I said, well, so what? And he said that he wasn't sure yet, but he thinks that it means something in the future to be Picasso. He says that occasionally there's a Picasso, and he happens to be him. He said the 20th century must start somewhere, and why not now? And then he said, may I have you? And I said, OK. And he walked upstairs and picked up my bricks and turned it over, and took his fingernail and scratched deeply along the back of my hand. And in a second, in red, the image of a dove appeared. And then I thought, why is it that someone who wants me can hang around for months? And I even like him, but I'm not going to sleep with him. Someone else says the right thing, and I'm on my back not knowing what hit me. Yeah, why is that? What? Never mind. <laughs> Seamen are always talking about their things like it's not them. What things? The things between their legs. Oh, we. Louis! <laughs> Again. Charlie, you don't understand what a nightmare it's been living through all these years with her. 
coming home every night wondering whether she's harmed herself. I'm so glad you've come back. I've needed someone. Hey, uh, don't cry, okay? Um, I have a little saved, and, and with what the foundation pays me, I'll, I'll be able to send you some money for a while. You're not going away. You have to stay with us now. Well, well, I gotta do some traveling, make a few speeches, but, but, but. Right now, I think I'm about as close to you as I can possibly be. 